All right, friends, good day. We have another daily devotional. It is July 8th, and we continue with Psalm 119, which consists of 176 verses. So uh, yesterday we uh, talked about the first part of the psalm as well as an introduction, so you can review that if you haven't yet done so. We're going to pick up today with Psalm uh, with verse 89 through the end, which is 176. So Psalm 89 starts with the Lord exists forever. God is before and after. You and I, we don't know how this works. We, uh, everything we know has a beginning, but God has no beginning. God exists forever. And that's the way that it is. You can try and figure that out. Good luck to that. That won't happen. Uh, the psalmist uh, continues to uh, uh, emphasize the love of the law. And uh, you also have the psalmist wanting to highlight the importance of the psalmist teachers who teach the law. And in addition, you have uh, an affirmation of the psalmist doing what is right, even though the oppressors say otherwise. The decrees of the Lord are wonderful, and because they are so wonderful, the soul keeps them. So there's a big emphasis here on the importance of the law and the importance of keeping it. So Psalm 19 begins to come to a close where the psalmist uh, asked God to rescue him from his misery. And uh, the psalmist looks at the faithlessness, those who are not faithful, who are not keeping the ways of the, of the Lord, and looks at them with disgust. But the psalmist says, you know, I love your precepts. I love what you want. Uh, the summary of your word is truth. And those who think otherwise are judged. Uh, so the psalmist uh, is, is uh, emphasizing the importance of the law and praising forth uh, the words of faithfulness. And the psalmist longs for God's salvation because the law is a delight. It's not drudgery. I keep the law. It's a good thing. I enjoy it. Uh, God has given me this and I will keep it. And the psalmist ends by saying, I will not forget. I will not forget your commandments. Remembrance is important. We remember what God has done for us and we therefore respond. All right. That's Psalm 119. Let us pray. Gracious God, thank you for your law and your precepts and everything that you've given to us. Help us to be faithful in all that you give to us, in all that we say, in all that we do. In Jesus' name, amen. All right, folks. Hasta mañana.